Ladies and gentlemen, welcome to Punk Rock Review, home of a bunch of opinionated crap you don't care about, also the home of the feedback you provide that we don't care about, keeps us on an even playing field, and we like that. Real quick shout out to our sponsor, absolutely no one, feel bad and give us money. Anyhow, moving straight into it today, today we're going to be talking about yet a, uh, another little Marvel flick that uh, we regret seeing in any way, shape, or form, and of course we are talking about the one and only Doctor Strange Multiverse of Madness. So, Doctor Strange Multiverse of Madness, what can be said about this one? Well, man, uh, it just kind of seems like disappointment comes in all shapes and sizes and in all versions of the multiverse, uh, you know, uh, as of late that Marvel movies, uh, you know, kind of uh, capture and encapsulate and such, uh, just disappointment appointment man comes in all shapes and sizes uh, and this one comes in the uh, you know package of everything that's offered when you sit down and watch this crap man from the story to the character interactions to even the action scenes man this one falls into yet another waste that leaves fans more disappointed uh, you know in the disservice this does to the universe itself than to the service it provides to its fans uh, you know we're huge Doctor Strange fans love the the first Doctor Strange movie, man, but, uh, you know, can't help but ever since Avengers, man, hit its plateau and stopped with Endgame and things of that nature, man, uh, it's just been like a shit show as far as everything that Marvel's been putting out and whatnot. Uh, don't know if it's, uh, you know, them just trying to to recapture the glory of, uh, you know, what they were able to do uh, when they had, like, a steady storyline and such that they were following and everything. Uh, but, man, it's just like they're throwing a bunch of shit at the wall, seeing what sticks, and when they eventually do get something that could be a very good, uh, you know, story arc or storyline to go through. Or even if they, uh, you know, rip something from one of the comic books or something like that and were to follow it, man, uh, their execution of it is just all wonky, man, and just not good. Uh, really leaves for a disappointing watch, uh, you know, yeah, as of, uh, you know now no care to even see another uh you know marvel movie and that's a sad thing man uh you know for folks like us that grew up uh fans of marvel and whatnot before any of the movies were out uh you know and you just longed to see them in the big screen and then finally when uh you know the x-men hit and then they rolled out the fantastic four and a couple of the toby Maguire spider-mans eventually you know it's like okay uh even those man are better than the shit that they're putting now nowadays uh yeah some some issues man uh dr strange multiverse of madness ah oh, man what a shitty movie uh there you go that's the review man yeah that movie sucks uh so watch it don't watch it we don't care we just want your money so give us money uh dr strange multiverse of madness what can be said about you uh, well, let's see. No Way Home got the disappointment, uh, so you just get the uh, ass for Sucky, because uh, it is. It's Sucky. So, there you go. Uh, that's it. Give us money. Have a good one, you probably didn't. We'll catch you next time. Probably won't.